you're in southern Indiana, we're prepared for a little bit of lightning and some heavy rainfall. This is your radar over the past hours. These slow moving pop up storms have been tracking towards Seymour. There's a significant amount of lightning within this. This will extend just to the north of Bedford as well as this line slowly moves off. We will be done with the rain and the storms out there, at least during the first part of the day today. We're essentially sitting in between two weather systems, one that's fizzling out from yesterday. That's kind of what's prompting what's out there this morning. But then we've got a more potent storm system that's brewing to our northwest, and that's what's going to bring in the more widespread rain chances as we get into the early part of next week. In the meantime, this is what we've got. Mostly cloudy skies, hazy conditions, and that's what we're going to be essentially dealing with all morning long. We're at 74 degrees, but your dew point temperature is at 72. Anytime we've got a dew point of 70 or above, we consider that miserable as far as the mugginess in the air. And unfortunately, we're going to be right here in the low 70s, kind of in that miserable zone from start to finish today. So keep that in mind for any outdoor plans you might have which might include a day at the State Fair going to be opening up this morning as temperatures rebound from the 70s back into the 80s and then eventually by 6 p.m. around 89 forecasting a high today near 90 for us here in the Indy Metro 87 in Muncie 89 in Shelbyville and also that chance of a few stray pop up. So here's that latest timeline as we go from now through about noon. Notice not a lot going to be out there, but then as we get into the heat of the day, these isolated pop up showers and storms will be a possibility. Here's 5 p.m. and then on into the evening tonight. Again, not great rain chances, but something to at least keep an eye on if you do plan on being outside during the second half of the day today. Now tomorrow, same deal. We've got the heat really cranking tomorrow. 73 to get the day started. 92 for your Sunday afternoon. And then we're going to keep it hot into the first part of next week. 88 and then eventually looking ahead at the rest of the week. We do find a little relief from that high humidity with more seasonal temperatures in the low to mid 80s by next Wednesday.